Okay guys, this is August 12th, 2013, and I have a few updates for you guys. I just figured I'd make this video uh, because, well, one, I'm bored, and two, a lot of things have changed in the past 12 hours. Um, so, uh, like I said, it is August 12th. Uh, I go back to school tomorrow on the 13th, so I will be back to school in that time. So I won't be making quite as many videos as I have been, but uh, then again, that should be should still be okay. I haven't been making a ton of videos lately. Um, so that's the first update. Going back to school, you know, summer got kind of boring, so I figured, yeah, I want to go back to school. But second update, as you can see here, my room setup has completely changed uh, 100%. Well, not 100%, all this is still the same, but the rest has changed around. My bed's now over here. And then we have the table next to the mini fridge. And then we have my computer desk right here. This is the original place it was when I first got it. But uh, yeah, tons of things have changed since then. That was back in 2011, so. Yeah, there you go. That's my new desk setup. Um, there's still a bunch of stuff laying around, as you can see. I haven't done anything with a lot of that yet, uh, just because, you know, this was a lot of work and I just got lazy. But, uh, yeah, you can see that my bed's right here. Um, I did actually purchase one thing. I purchased this uh, long power bar up here at the hardware store. I got it for, like, I don't know, 40 bucks. And it has, let's see, okay, let me get a flashlight. So I can show you what I'm talking about. Alrighty, so under here, as you can see, it's a power bar. Um, it extends almost the entire length of this portion of the desk. It uh, has six outlets with plenty of space between them. And uh, yeah, it's got a 15 amp circuit breaker in it, so that's cool. And uh, yeah, so I just mounted it up there, and you can see all of my my plugs have been uh, occupied except for one over there but as you can see I've tried to do a little bit with cable management but it didn't really go as planned um, I could have done better but I didn't want to because of one thing I will tell you guys in a minute uh, but yeah anyway that's that uh, so okay so I have two more things to talk about or three four more things actually uh, so the the other, the, I don't know, yeah, okay, anyway, the first of those four being that I'm getting a new uh, bed frame and a headboard, so it's going to be cool, I'll have a couple of drawers down there, it's going to be just a frame that goes all the way around, I'm also, I got that, um, that is going to be here within probably, ne probably sometime next week, and I also got a new mattress, so that's cool too. And yeah, the th it's basically just a big white box. It's a little wider and a little longer. And it's going to have a headboard up there that goes up to about there. And it's going to have um, like cubby holes and stuff. So yeah, it'll have like a bookcase, bookshelf thing, kind of, sort of. And we'll have two drawers down there for storage. So that's going to be here very soon. And then the other thing would be uh, you see this carpet right here? It's about 30 years old, maybe older. Um, I, we're planning to get hardwood flooring in the bedroom, so we have it uh, in the rest of the house, as you can see. But we're planning to get it in the bedrooms now, too. So that means, uh, whenever we're doing that, it might be in a month, might be in three months, I don't know. But whenever we're doing that, about a week before, I have to start moving literally everything out of this room. And it's going to be just like moving, basically, and that's not going to be fun. Uh, just believe me, switching all this stuff around today was still took a lot of time. Okay, so now that we got that out of the way, I, like I said, uh, just to sum up, I had planned to have a lot of different room updates uh, going, so there will be no room tour for this month. Um, so, actually no, there will be a room tour for this month after I get the frame, but uh, yeah, so there you go. The other thing being is I posted the Nokia 6350 on eBay yesterday and because you know of the unsatisfactory build quality uh, with the phone and I sold it today so it's all packaged up it's ready to go I'm gonna ship that out tomorrow 
and I have all of this stuff over here. Uh, that's a Motorola uh, phone case, an 8 gigabyte adapter, and a singular SIM card. That is all for my Motorola Razr 2, which I also bought yesterday. Um, that should be here either. I It says tomorrow, the 13th, like, I ordered two-day shipping, or I paid for two-day shipping. Uh, so that means if it shipped out today, it should be here tomorrow, but I'm kind of doubtful about that. It could be as late as Wednesday or Thursday that it gets here, but I don't really care that much. As long as it gets here at some point this week, that's pretty cool. Uh, so I'll have a proper a proper cell phone. Um, a lot of people were complaining about that video I made critiquing the build quality of this thing. They were like, oh, why does it matter? Why did you even buy this thing anyway? Well, I bought it because of sentimental value, basically. I want to get I want to get back into cell phone collecting too. Um, and I always I always had a soft spot for flip phones. Um, you know, I didn't get a smartphone until late 2011, so anyway, yeah. And so that's why I bought that phone and even though I'm not going to be using it a whole lot, maybe I'll be using the Razer for a week or two just to I'm going to do another retro challenge type thing, but that's another video. Um, but even though I'm not going to be using it a whole lot, I still want it to be, you know, satisfactory, of satisfactory build quality. And I've owned a Razer 2 V9X for over two years. Well, I have, anyway. I, I got rid of mine in late 2011, but I owned one for over two years, so I know that phone is 100% solid and built much better than this phone, so... When that come in, when that comes in, expect an unboxing, and yeah, I'm just that's going to be a much better phone than this one. So, yeah, I think that is pretty much that. Pretty much sums it up uh, in terms of the updates. Uh, this is a pretty pretty uh, big update video, so I'm glad I made it. But anyway, yeah, I'd like to thank you guys for watching this video, and I will see you later.